Welcome back to Let the Quran Speak. And now we answer questions we've received from you, our viewers. If you have a question yourself, you can visit our website, www.quranspeaks.com. Okay, Brother Shabir, the question we have is, uh, does the Quran provide timings of the five daily prayers? Only in a very vague and general way, but the precise timings as we observe them for our five daily prayers now are stated in the hadith, which are uh, shown uh, as the example of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Okay, the next question is, uh, why is the Qur'an so repetitive? My understanding is that every word um, and phrase should count. And they do actually, uh, either for greater emphasis, uh, for, uh, you, you can say, uh, drumming in the message to the reader, or sometimes uh, things which appear to be a repetition of something already said elsewhere is said with some nuance or twist that will actually give a different flavor or other dimension to the same message. So it's important, the repetition is important in some well, way. Well, uh, ultimately we say this is in the wisdom of God. God must know why he has actually said the same thing twice, uh, and, and we just listen to it twice and hope hope that that actually means something for us yeah well we have like for example the the surah ar-rahman which repeats one uh, refrain over and over again yes and we're, we're glad this does not occur in every surah yes. but at the same time those who recite surah ar-rahman delight in the fact of this very repetition it means something for us in this surah all right thank you for your time brother shabir you're welcome and that's all the time we have you can visit our website www.quranspeaks.com Send us your comments, your suggestions, and of course your donations. I'm Sophia Ali for all of us here at Let the Quran Speak. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next week.